It is time. Time for the light round. Chris Hatcher, Rob Cool, of course, Hayden, let's talk to Bob Bell, myself, who is just near a cold cigar. I don't know, my step is like you planned it, sir. And then the lightning round is over. Are you ready? Ski dad. Time for the light round. Chris, I want to start with Roy in California. Roy. Hi, Jim. I uh, appreciate your program and what you do. And, uh, Thank you. I have a question about uh, energy transfer partners. ET, I like it. ET, I think it's a very good company. Now, here's the the only problem is it has run, but the whole group is indeed moving, and it only yields eight percent. Let's go. I mean, it was still got some yield to it. Let's go to Steve in New York. Steve. Hey Jim, thanks for taking my call. I got All a right. question uh, regarding uh, this AI is taking such a nice run. I take some profits off the table. I'm looking to. Uh, diversify a little bit. I'm looking at the financial sector, especially private equity uh, company called KKR. Oh, they're very good at what they do. I've known them for 40 years. They're just really good. Stocks had a big run now, uh, and so is Blackstone, but they're very good. And that's, uh, I think they can make more money than they have. Victor in New Jersey. Victor! Hey, Booyah, Jim. How are you? I am good, Victor. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Thank you. Hey, Jim, I like your show and also uh, love your interviews with Jason Wong last week. That was oh, fantastic. thank you. Thank you. That was fun yeah. with Jensen. That was really great. Thank you. Great. Yeah, my question is uh, Becton Dickinson, simple PDF. The stock has been getting crushed. It's really inexpensive now. I think it's a buy. Uh, you know, we had, we had Tom Poland on. I, I think he told a pretty good story, but nobody likes it. It's been flat now for months. I think it's the time to buy the stock. Let's go to Jeff in Massachusetts. Jeff. Hi, Jim. How are you? I'm calling from Boston to home of the next NBA world champion, Boston Celtics. Oh, I didn't know that they had already named named them that. I thought there was like a series that those... Well, go ahead. Go ahead. What's up? Well, anyway, I just had to say that. I'm sorry. Uh, IOT, Sam Sora. Oh, my God. This is the hottest stock, and it's going to make money, too, and it's really good, and I do agree. They do... You know, this is a dev op shop, okay? When you can develop... A platform that develops hardware, software platforms. I mean, it's a hardware, software platform. People love these kinds of stocks. They can't live without them. Let's go to Alessandro in New York. Alessandro. Hey, Mr. Kramer. Good afternoon. Thank you for taking my call. Of course. Uh, thank you. City, a long-time listener. Thank you very much for many uh, good recommendations. I oh, thank you. Hold out. Uh, position uh, in tech, I was a little bit heavy. I, I brought some uh, um, profit home, okay. and I wanted to do some rotation. So I'm right. looking at Rio Tinto. Uh, oh, I think it's a great company to buy here. A mineral company, I think it's a terrific idea. I was looking at it myself as something to buy after Southern Copper's moved up so much. That's a really good idea. Let's go to Andrew in New Jersey. Andrew. Hey, how you doing, Jim? I'm doing good. How about you? I'm doing good myself. Thanks for asking. I uh, I wanted to refer to a, a, a reference you made with the AI race. You compared it to refrigerators and how we should be looking for our quote-unquote Coca-Cola within the AI race. And yes. so I was wondering if Coherent Corporation out of PA, stock ticker COHR. A lot of lasers, a lot of that. optics, a lot of good stuff. Going to uh, going to make money this year. I think you're right. I would buy some here and then wait for it to come down. Let's go to Mark in Minnesota. Mark. Jimmy, it's great to talk to you, man. Oh, thank you. Same. Glad you're on the phone. What's going on? I adopted early on uh, Tesla and on doggies from the Humane Society. All right. So I got a question about New Fortress Energy, NFE. You know, this is West Uh, Eaton's. We have to have West back on. You know, the government decided they would have to put on pause any 2028 uh, LNG. Boy, what just a dumb, dumb idea. And that may have put New Fortress in a different light. I think this company is a buy, and I think West Eaton's is absolutely terrific at what he does. I like that stock here. Let's go to Pete in Delaware. Pete. Hey, Jim. How are you? Thanks. I am good. How about you? Great. Thank you so much. Hey, I wanted to get your opinion about um, something. I think it's a sort of a niche company representing the fourth largest economy in the world, California Resources Corp. C R C. Yeah, I remember when that was spun off. Okay, so they're doing a lot of they're doing a lot of decarbonization. People regarding is that I would rather be in Constellation Energy if I'm going to be in that. Let's just go right to the source. Let's go to Constellation. How about Jerry in Nebraska, Jerry? Hey Jim, thanks for taking my call. Hey, I read. 
I read soon that Pure Storage is providing customers with a nice framework to manage high-performance data and computer requirements. And you're right. And, that, and you're right. Fun. And they're making money. And again, this is another stock that has run so much. I have to say, I have to advise you to buy some and then wait for a pullback. It just runs so much. Many of these lightning round stocks have run so much that I'm a little gun shy. That's why I say buy some in case it keeps going up, but don't buy all so you have some cash left. Let's go to Sharon in Minnesota. Sharon. Hi, Jim. Uh, I'm a member, and I bought my first one-third of the Elf. And the problem, I guess it's a good problem. It's already doubled. I and know. Elf is amazing. Tamarang and Min is doing a great job. He's doing much better in the stocks that I like in the segment. I would hold on to that. Don't buy more and don't sell. And that, ladies and gentlemen, conclusion of the Lightning Round. The Lightning Round is sponsored by Charles Schwab. Coming up, when is change at the top a good thing? Boeing and the Mouse House taught the street a lesson today. Kramer breaks it all down. Next. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on X. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Mentions. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.